Traditionally, operations for video service providers were pretty static affairs. There was one type of network delivering a set group of channels. That world, as we all know, has been turned upside down by the internet and ever more competition. The performance of the network now is paramount, and to ensure that performance, monitoring is vital. In some cases, it helps providers confront problems when they occur. In others, it detects them before they impact the viewer. The world of monitoring is changing. In the past, the key was the quality of service, QoS. It now has a partner. Increasingly, quality of experience, QoE, is considered as well. While QoS is a purely technical metric, QoE is a subjective rating of how programming actually looks and sounds. A simple analogy. If a package that is shipped from Beijing to Paris arrives, its QoS is fine. If the expensive vase within is broken into a thousand pieces, well, that's a QoE problem. QoE can be an especially useful tool when things are not outrightly broken. Networks sometimes are operational, but the video and audio content can be broken or overly compressed. Imagine a stream in which both the QoS and the QoE are fine, until high action sports or film programming predominate. At that point, the QoE may sink. QoE monitoring will find the information to improve things. Here's another change. In the past, video service providers would select one channel at a time for video and audio content quality monitoring. The monitoring was done often, but not continuously. Advances now enable all channels to be monitored, all in real time. Real time, deep insight into what is happening and how it affects video and audio quality at the content level is a massive change for the better. It also makes things more complex, since more data is collected. This leads to the use of advanced business intelligence platforms to determine precisely what is going on. Video service providers must also think ahead. Careful placement of monitoring equipment isolates issues. Monitoring where video enters the head end, where it leaves, and at various points in the network can logically isolate a problem and reduce mean time to detection and mean time to repair. Video service providers today have unprecedented opportunities. They also have unprecedented competition. The first and perhaps most important step toward excelling is knowing what is happening and how it affects a viewer's quality of experience. Monitoring has never been more important.